hey you guys welcome back to another video of mine today i will be giving you guys a pregnancy update for mr fella down here oh i'm out of breath y'all i had to sit on this chair and i'm like wiped out <laughs> um yeah so i'm here to tell you guys a few things about my pregnancy how i've been doing so far regarding my pregnancy and what's to come so basically um i am now seven and a half months i know crazy time goes by so fast i remember when i first found out i was like shocked and i didn't know what to think how to feel or anything of that i just knew like oh i'm having a baby and now i'm here and i'm like ready for him to come because <laughs> i am tired so yeah i'm seven and a half months i turned seven and a half months literally this past thursday on thanksgiving i hope you all had a great thanksgiving by the way and yes so now the next holiday will be christmas and i'll be damn near nine months by then <laughs> so it's just flying 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 um i have a little list that i made so that i can remember because i do have pregnancy rain sometimes so for all my mommies out there you guys understand you guys know but other than that um like i mentioned before i'm having a boy um i wanted a girl at first um for my own preference i have my own reasons behind that um but other than that i'm glad that i'm still having a boy um because i just always i always told myself like i wanted a boy first so that he can protect his you know his sisters in the future when i have girls because i will be having more kids at the right time that's like a while from now it's no time soon because <sighs> i am tired i am definitely tired and yeah so um i do not have a name for him just yet i have a couple in store but i'm not set in stone on a name because as y'all know it's so hard choosing one name when there's like a gazillion names out there in the world that you can name your child so <laughs> bear with me on that you guys will find out the name once he's probably finally born um and then you know he'll be here and i'll just be ready to just like give him all the love that i want to give him he's already loved by so many um it was really really crazy in the beginning of my pregnancy i was throwing up all the time and literally going through it now i got over that you know morning sickness as i should say all day sickness and i am now healthy and ready to pop <laughs> so i will show you guys how my belly looks after i go through all the questions so you guys can get a like an idea of how big i am and you know how far along i am so um yeah let me just go through my list like i said i have a list here on my phone um yeah as i said it i'm getting bigger by the day like every day it seems like he is growing some people think that i'm small but like from for me you know from not having like a big belly like that to go from no belly to a big belly i feel like huge and, and like it's different when you're actually carrying a baby so i tend to not even listen to anyone when they're like you're not that big i'm like i'm big <laughs> to me i am so yes i'm definitely getting bigger <sighs> i don't know if he's gonna be a big baby or a small baby but regardless i'm gonna love him to pieces um yes i told you guys i don't have a name yet um he kicks all the time like all the time especially at night that's like his favorite time to like go crazy so like he'll kick here and there throughout the day like letting me know like mommy i'm right here you feel me what's up <laughs> but at night he just like turns into a boxer or a karate kid because he just wilds 
out completely like crazy and like when I'm sleeping at night if I let my dog like lay with me he'll like lay by my stomach it's like so adorable you guys it's crazy um as at first you know I was thinking of having a home birth you know because of the pandemic and it being safer but it's pretty expensive you know to have a home birth plus I'm a little bit you know worried because this is my first child and I wanted to make sure that I'm like doing everything like the right way and the safest way possible so I definitely believe that I will be having him at the hospital because Lord knows I'm gonna need you know that extra support Speaking of support, I have a doula, and if you guys, for those of you out there that do not know what a doula is, a doula is, you know, a lady or someone in, you know, support of your pregnancy and helps you out and supports you, you know, through your pregnancy, gives you tips, gives you, you know, things that you need to know, anything that you really need, they'll provide and help you with. And then they also help you through through labor and delivery. So I'm very thankful for that. That definitely came in clutch because I know a lot of women tend to just, you know, wing it, go in there and just do their thing. And I'm like, I need a little bit of extra support because <laughs> this is my first time and I want to make sure that like I'm doing everything at least right. I know it won't be perfect, but as long as I'm going on the right track, I'll feel better, you know, about that when I have a little bit more support. So, yeah, other than that, more symptoms that I have regarding my pregnancy. Um, I don't have too much cravings. Like, if I do crave anything, it'll probably be, like, noodles or, like, pho. Like, you know, the soup pho. It's a, I believe it's a Korean or an Asian dish. It's very, very good. I, like, crave that a lot like a lot of soup dishes I already was like a soup fiend before i was even pregnant but like now even more especially since it's a boy and they say like boys like tend to allow you to crave like salty savory stuff omg like i love to eat like noodles 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 or pho and i try to aim to be healthy as much as possible but those are definitely my cheap foods when I want, you know, to snack and satisfy that craving that I'm having. <sighs> I have bad back pain, OMG, like no other, you know, as I, as you guys know, I'm getting <laughs> bigger. So the bigger I get, the more back problems I have. I have a pregnancy belt to help with my belly, but it tends to just help for like a temporary moment and then goes right back to it, especially you know, if I'm driving and stuff like that's when like my back will burn, like literally burn. It's crazy how to explain it. Like, I don't know how else to explain it. I'm sure you pregnant moms or moms out there that are already have kids and know exactly what I mean. But yeah, so a lot of back pain, a lot of stomach pains, you know, due to me growing. And other than that, um, I don't, like I said, I don't throw up anymore. I don't have those nausea feelings. Sometimes if I smell something, I may get like a nauseated feeling. But other than that, like, I'm so glad that's overweight, you guys. You do not understand how torturing it is for you to go through that. And I think I went through it for about like maybe four months from the beginning of my pregnancy until about like four, four and a half months. I went through that nauseated feeling of waking up and going to the bathroom all day long because I had morning and all day sickness. Um, other than that, um, I can barely fit any of my clothes. Like I'm even like busting out of this shirt and I just got this shirt literally like last month so that I can like fit. <laughs> And now I'm like busting out of it and it's crazy because like I thought I would be able to fit it. And so I did just purchase some clothes um, not too long ago. I actually did a fashion haul, a Sheen fashion haul. And I will link that down below in my description. So if you guys didn't get a chance to check it out, you guys could definitely head to my description box and click on a link so that you guys can watch that video. But yeah, I got more comfortable, stretchable clothes. So like the bigger I get, 
the more comfortable I'll be because the clothes will, you know, stretch with me and stuff. So, yes, that's what I did. Um, I got more clothes so that I can be comfortable. And that's basically it. I really didn't have anything else on my list, at least, you know, to tell you guys about my pregnancy. Like I told you, I don't have a name yet, and that will be a surprise until, you know, he's born and I, you know, cut down and, you know, just settle down on what I actually want him to be named and stuff like that and everything of that sort. Um, like I said, he's so loved. Um, he pretty much has all that he needs. Thank God. Thank you to Jesus because he, if it wasn't for him, I don't know what I would do. <laughs> Other than that, um, he's a pretty good boy. He kicks a lot. That's basically it. And I can't wait to meet him. And I can't wait for you guys to meet him once he's actually here. So I'm glad I'm like knocking out all these videos now because Lord knows I have less and less energy the closer and closer I get to my delivery date and that's coming soon i'm seven and a half months so you guys already know i only have like a month and a half to go and i'm like nervous i'm like anxious i'm scared i'm happy i'm excited like i have all these emotions bottled in one and i just can't control them i try to like breathe so like i will know like okay other moms did it i can do it too but it's still like a very very like shocking ordeal for me because i've never been through this before this is my first time this is my first child and i just wanted to go the right way i know it's not gonna be perfect but i just wanted to just be safe and healthy so you guys pray for me out there all you moms or whoever's tuning in and yeah so let me show you guys my belly and how i look now so you guys can get an idea of what i look like at seven and a half months so yeah okay you guys this is how I look you guys literally just see me in my fashion haul like I said the link is in my description box but this is how big I am now guys OMG to be honest I never even thought I would be able to get pregnant and then like once I found out I was pregnant I was like shocked like oh my gosh it was so unexpected it wasn't planned and that's another answer for you guys if it was planned or not no it was not so this is how big I am the baby the belly <laughs> look guys and he moves a lot he's not moving right now I'm sure he's probably asleep but you guys yes i'm like a big old basketball now so yeah here he is so other than that thank you guys so much for tuning in to my pregnancy update and i can't wait to see you guys on my next video make sure to like comment down below and make sure you comment down below what names i should name him if you guys have anything in mind if not that's perfectly fine but make sure to like comment and subscribe so that you guys could be updated and stay on stay in touch with me and when i announce more videos so i love you guys see you soon Mwah.